Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Jut Vidan Vitiani. Here I would like to present my research proposal with the title The Benefits English Preservice Teachers Experiences During Performing Reflective Practices A Case at Reflective in Micro Teaching Class. Background of the study Micro teaching is a variation of lesson study which is applied by student teachers in micro teaching courses where they practice teaching to their peers or real student and it combines the aspects from micro teaching and lesson study. Those aspects are the teaching of small group or peers or real students and the certain length of time for teaching approximately 25 to 30 minutes and the, div the division of the student teachers in group of three, the cycle of collaborative lesson planning, teaching and reflecting, and the use of video to capture teacher lessons for later analysis. At the English Education Department of Silwang University, micro teaching is over to the fifth semester English student teachers who take reflective in micro teaching course. And many studies have explored the benefits for the reflective practice for the real teaching. And the research student teachers micro teaching experiences in the Preservice English Teacher Education Program written by Ismail S. 2011 discuss about the benefits of micro teaching as a prospective teacher perceived them. As Ismail S. 2011 said that micro teaching is also intended to provide teacher trainees with additional practical experience before they start their clinic, clinical practice in real classes. That research highlighted that micro teaching has a potential to impact preserve teacher in the real teaching. A research question addressed in the present study is how the English preservers teachers experience during performing reflective practices in the micro teaching class can give the benefits for their teaching in the future. So with this question, the participant will answer their experience during performing reflective, reflective practice, what they feel and what the benefits they get from micro teaching and effective in micro teaching class. Research method. This research is use case study. So why this research use case study? According to you in 2003, a case study design should be considered when A, the focus of the study is to answer how and why question. B, you cannot manipulate the behavior of those involved in the study. C, you want to cover contextual conditions because you believe they are relevant to the phenomenon under study. And D, the boundaries are not clear between the phenomenon and context because case study is relevant to the phenomenon under study of the researcher. Setting and participants. The participant of this research is undergraduate of English Education Department of Siliwang University who enroll in micro teaching subject. More specific, the participant will be English Education Department 2017 who enroll micro teaching subject, especially Class C. They will give a research question and they have to answer based on the experience in reflective micro teaching class during reflective practice. And then related to the proposal, the step of the research so will be the step one is identify the problem, two, review the literature, three, clarify the problem, four, clarify defined terms and concepts, five, define the population, six, develop the instrument, plane, seven, collect the data, eight, analyze the data, and the last is writing the report. And then the references that use in this proposal is, this is 
about the references. So that's all about my research proposal presentation. Thank you for the attention. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.